Hi everyone. Um, I have a quick little card share for you today. I uh, was playing around with some scraps that I have on my desk and I wanted to use one of my Gorgeous Girl stamps because I bought the new ones and haven't had a chance to use them yet. So I picked out this one. Ooh, sorry about the glare. And she is, what's her name? The White Rabbit. So I'm assuming it's probably kind of like a, um, a take on the Alice in Wonderland with the big, big clock in her hand and calling it the White Rabbit. And she's in her pajamas. So I stamped her out and colored her up and I made a card. So let me just show you. Sorry, get used to the camera angle here. Um, I say I use scraps on my desk because I had uh, this piece here. This is the resist paper that I colored with um, Tim Holtz Distress Inks and uh, Glimmer Mist. And that was from a card that I made a while ago with one of the, um, the magical beans from the Greening Farm. So I had had this piece cut out and I punched the edges with the Martha Stewart corner punch and I backed it on the silver paper, but it just wasn't the right size. So it just ended up sitting on my desk. So basically I used that and then I had these bling, it's a big bling corner from the dollar store. And that was just sitting on my desk also. <laughs> and these roses are left over from the, um, the ones that I used on my ballet journal. I made four of them and I only used one, so I used the three that were left on here. And I found these um, paper flowers, and I was saying before that I bought these paper flowers and I believe it was from a scrapbook store that was closing out. And I was saying that it wasn't a brand that I don't think is around anymore. It actually is, they just don't make flowers anymore. It's, it's Kaiser Craft. Um, is the company. So I have all of these, they're all these size and just different colors. And these ones just match perfectly with the turquoise. And I used those um, shattered glass blings from my dollar store, just in the center of those. And I pulled out these little white flowers and I believe they're either from I Am Roses or Wild Orchid Crafts. I had just bought them as like a little filler flower and I haven't used them yet. So I used those in there. Um, I colored her up with Copics and I'm sorry I did not keep a list of the colors on this one because I just went into another project right away. So um, I did use some Wink of Stella on the clock and I also used Crystal Accents so you can see that it's like all shiny. Um, and then I used Wink of Stella just on her necklace and I think that was pretty much it. And I stamped this saying out. And that was from this birthday, this Fisker's birthday set that I got at a garage sale. Oops. So again, there's the front. Very adorable. I don't usually use a lot of purpley colors, so this one is kind of cute. Um, the background paper is actually from a die cuts with a view glimmer. It's the Glimmer Posies or something like that is a really old set and I ended up buying the single sheets from Michaels when they were clearing them out so I have a ton of them still. And then I just used some purple cardstock. And then the inside, this is the, the, pat the pattern paper that's on the front, you just can't see it. And I used this, this was just a um, an extra piece of purple that was sitting on my desk also from the last card that I made. And this Thinking of You I used is from um, this set here from Close to My Heart. It's called For Every Occasion Occasions. And then I added in some more of the flowers and the little rock crystal bling. So that is it. That is my little card that I made. Leave a comment, subscribe if you wish, and have a great day. Thanks. Bye.